try again and we're going to practice a sequence that's called the lizard warm-up. Now the reason it's called the lizard warm-up is we do a half version of the pose lizard which is a deep stretch into the hips. So I'd like you to start by coming into cat pose please. Resting the hands below the shoulders and I'd like you to tuck the toes under moving into downward facing dog so that's allowing the hips to drift high, keeping the knees bent if you need to, and allowing the head to gently fall towards the mat, lifting and elevating the hips. So from here, what we're going to do is we're going to give our toes a little bit of a warm up. So I'd just like you to roll the toes over one at a time. So we really work into those small joints in the feet. And from here, after you've done this on each side, we're going to lower both knees simultaneously and fold into swan pose. So taking a long insulin in Inhalation as you come up. I'd like you to take the right foot forward and allow this arm to drift down onto the floor, the inside arm down onto the floor. And I'd like you to stretch forward and move round so you're taking the back of the hand onto the sacrum and you're gently rotating the chest towards the knee, lifting and lengthening. Well done. Allowing the arm to come back round, having a gentle elevation with the arms. Very well done. Folding over the knee, tucking the back knee under, and then straightening out that leg, pushing into the heel. And we're gonna get you to move back momentarily into plank pose. Now from plank pose, feel free to drop the knees, but we're tucking the elbows in, lowering down, and dropping the knees and scooping up into something that's a really deep back bend for some of us. Cobra, you might want to lower the elbows to do a more gentle version. Very well done. And gently folding, folding, folding. Inhaling again, taking the left foot forward this time. Well done. And the inside hand comes onto the floor, resting next to the foot. We stretch out and we're moving round so that we allow the back of the hand to rest onto the sacrum. Well done. And we're taking a gentle rotation. We're moving that shoulder back. Well done. Superb. All the way back round to neutral. Let's tuck the back toe under. Back into your plank pose. Drop the knees if you need to. Otherwise, a deep chaturanga, a deep press up, up into sphinx or cobra, and gently fold. Allowing yourself to come into a kneeling position now, lifting the arms up towards the ceiling. Well done. Thank you. Well done. <laughs>